Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to get the Squid Game avatars and NPCs to your Icon 7.9 and animate them, read them, create 3D animation in Icon 7.9. You can just scroll down, go to my video description there. <clears throat> the first link download Squid Game avatar and NPC 3D models from here. Click into this link. It will link you to this website. This is a Sketchfab, Sketchfab search result here. So let's say if I want to download this, I can just right click, open in a new tab. And then, it will load the 3D models at here. So if I want to download some, some can be downloaded. So just click here, download the 3D model. And then log in with your Google account. Just sign in. And then download 3D model. You can download the DAE format. After you download it, it is a zip file. Just download it first. As demo, I will put this in my desktop. Right, this is a zip file. I right click it, extract all, and click extract it. Once I extract it, it will become a folder. Right click the model, extract all, extract it. Inside the model, I have the DAE file. In order to use the DAE file, I will use the blender. Use the blender to convert the DAE file into FBX format. So now I just delete Delete the camera, the cube, and the light. Then, then I will import this. File, import. Import the FBX file. It is at here. Copy. Control C to copy and paste here. Control V, enter. Wait, what I, I'm going to import is the DAE file, not the FBX file. Import the DAE. Here, copy. Control C to copy, Control V to paste, enter. Import the DAE file. And now we can just have a look. This is the DAE file. Turn on the texture and have a look. If without the texture, it's still okay. We just want to export it as FBX file. File, export as FBX. Export on my desktop. The path mode, I choose copy. Then here, activate it. And then I name it as Squid Game Soldier. Then export the FBX file. Now the FBX file is here and you have the texture. And then, now I will open my 3D Exchange 7. Just drag in, and click OK. So let's have a check. So now, the scale is too big already. The scale, I put it as 1. And I press F again. Now I turn this on. Here, reset the transform, and change it to 1 again. No, change it to 10, change it to 50, no, 20, maybe I want about 25, no, 23, now it's okay already, click reset transform, 
align to the center, align to the ground. Now, and then now it is without the texture, without the texture yet. So about the texture, I just need to drag in from here, drag in, drop the texture at here. Now you can see, you can see the texture already. Drag down. Just have a look. The diffuse color, I put it as white color. Now, I export it as FBX file again. Export it as Maya format. Embed the texture. I will browse the desktop. Click OK. The Squid Game Soldier with texture. Click OK. Now this is the one that we want, but it is not yet have any of the rigs. That's why you cannot convert to to the avatar. You cannot convert to non-standard because you don't yet rig this avatar. So now I will just open my Mizamo. Mizamo.com I'm going to use the Mizamo to rig this avatar. The Mizamo you must log in. Log in the Mizamo just by using your Google. Log in by using your Google account. After that, you upload your character. You upload the character. Drag in the Squid Game Soldier with texture. Drag in here. And then you have to map the bones. This is a this is a, a Mizamo auto rigger. Now finish upload. Click next. And then now you can rig it. The elbow, you put it here, the knees, and the groin. Then, next, this is the auto rigger algorithm and can take up to two minutes, just wait for a while. Now, done already, click next. Then, next. And wait for a while, now it is going to appear here. And now it is ready to download. Just need to click download. Download with the tpost FBX file. Download. Now finish download already, you can check. Check your FBX file. I will click here, show in folder. Right, this is the one I drag into my 3D exchange and have a check. Is this really TPOS? Do you want to export the data? No. Import the animation, click OK. It is failed to import. So for this time, I just try to import into the icon 7 directly, drag in the FBX file and have a look. Edit animation layer. Now it, it is already in TPOS. Just click edit in 3D exchange. Click OK. Now click convert to non-standard. Choose Maya Human IK, active it, click Convert, and then click Apply to iClone. Before that, you have to delete this from iClone, and then Convert and click Apply to iClone. In your iClone 7, it already become an avatar. This string, you make it 100%. Right now, you can save this avatar, click here, click custom, click avatar, 
then click plus and this is a new avatar on the squid game soldier drag in you can perform some of the animation here already you can use it anytime just go to content where are you going to put it choose here go to the motions we test some of the animation here I cross seven motion mail whole guns start right now we just try to play to see now you can see it is ready for you to animate the squid game soldier All right you just have a look from here you still can download the NPCs you can download the cartoon version the stylized or the pink soldier all this you can download it and just have have a check some can can be downloaded some cannot it is up to you and just have fun that's all for today about how to get the squid game avatar and NPCs and import into your icon 7 to make any of the 3d animation and rig it create bones create animation and that's all for today thank you for watching if you love my video tutorial if you feel all these tutorials are very helpful to your 3d animation and game developing you can subscribe to my youtube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time i publish a new video tutorial you'll receive a notification immediately see you in my next video enjoy happy animation and game developing see you